Hey guys, Kurt here. Welcome to another video. In this video I will be, yeah, I didn't say what kind of video. I am actually doing a five of my favorite puzzles video. So these, this is not going to be a ranking or anything like that. I am just telling you that these five puzzles are some of my favorite puzzles to solve. Like I will, these are go-to puzzles that I will scramble up and leave on my table and solve throughout the day, just watching videos or, you know, doing, you know, just always have one or two of these always scrambled on my table. So we're going to go ahead and get in with that. And so, like I said, not a ranking. I'm not saying this is number one. This is my best. This is my favorite. Nah, this is, these are go-to puzzles that I go to. <laughs> so we'll go no particular order the Jing pyramids so I really enjoy this puzzle like it so much uh, yeah 3x3 three three shape mod if you didn't know well no that's not a 3x3 three three shape mod I'm sorry I am wrong it's just a tetrahedron yeah yeah I've gotten, I've got plenty of these. Uh, I got a keychain version. I got a mirror version. I got a void version. I even have the higher order versions up to the six by six, which I've done video tutorials on. I've done videos on all these. So yeah, yeah, that's one of my favorite puzzles that I always go to. So yeah, I don't know why everything looks so blown out, but oh well. Another one is the Mega Minx. Maybe I just need to bring it in. Maybe I should just turn off the light. How will that look? Yeah, there's enough light out there. Okay. Yeah, there's enough natural light that I don't need to do it. Okay, so the Mega Minx, yeah. Another one that I go to. Got plenty of these. Uh, unfortunately, they don't have a keychain version. Ah, uh, yeah. And then another one that I like to solve a lot is the uh, square two. So let's. There you go. So the one when I when I saw this, I had to get it, and yeah, it was so much fun to solve. It does add a little more of a challenge to the square one. So. And then actually a numeric puzzle. So a six by six. I love, like I really enjoy even number puzzles. They add so much more of a challenge than normal um, Normal odd puzzles, like you know, odd puzzles, not normal puzzles, but you get the idea. So yeah, the six by six. Yeah, I don't know what it is. It's like I remember the first six by six I had. It was a V cube six. It was a white one, and it broke, and so I bought another one. <laughs> but I've got so many six by sixes, so there may be a marathon in the works. Who knows? And, uh, yeah, the 8x8 Master Morphix. So I, I, you know, the Master Morphixes are usually ones that I go to. I do have, I actually have them all scrambled up and on the side right now. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, this, this, the 6x6 is a good one, but... I don't know. There's something about the eight by eight that, like, oops, sorry. There's something about the eight by eight that just I enjoy a little bit more than the six by six. So, and once again, it is a even numbered puzzle, so even layered puzzle. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I didn't really prepare for what I was going to talk about in this video at all. You know. So yeah, I've got videos actually for every one of these puzzles and numerous versions of them.
So yeah, this is uh, it's pretty much it. I don't know what else to talk about. <laughs> so five of my favorite puzzles, not in any particular order, just these are puzzles that, like I said, are usually one of these is on my table, scrambled up. Or I'm solving them, so yeah. Figured I'd do this, you know. If you guys enjoyed this, you know, let me know. And yeah, I guess that's about it. So thank you guys for watching. We'll go ahead and zoom out a bit. There you go. Get them all in there. <laughs> thank you guys for watching, and yeah, see you in the next one. Bye.